Now, President Museveni's government has come back with another strategy to politically fight the president of NUP, His Excellency Robert Chagulanyi Shentamu, aka Bobby Wine. Stand by for the details. Uh, Dr. Kiza Besije has sent a very strong message to Bobby Wine and his supporters who are mocking him on social media. I have the details. And I'm also coming to you with the latest shocking news from Mukono Municipality Member of Parliament, Horrible Betty Nambose's camp after collapsing in a bathroom. Well, 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 good morning. Thank you so much for being part of the Buzz family by subscribing to the Buzz UG. And in case you haven't, kindly subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Remember, I told you, you got the Buzz, you got everything. And my name is Melad Milo, aka Fuller, bringing to you these latest updates. Now, let me first give you an update from Evelyn Lagu's camp. Uh, we all know Evelyn Lagu recently collapsed after they castled her corset. I mean, that was breaking news to her. She couldn't believe it and she collapsed. Now, according to Vegas promoter, this one is her boyfriend. He says Evelyn Lagu is not yet any better and even yesterday she was on oxygen. That is in Chirudu Hospital. Uh, so, in a bad charity concert, so, Chibi, Kumakati, Omano, Kuve Joich, Nazri Kango, Malabi, Mona, Mona. But <laughs> Echivulu, orayo te chigenda sobo kakuba o, tu genda kuli nda tu labo mu omuwa dobo mu yembi, aterera di, nenga tu labo tu sobi la vasa ova tu ge ba isanda ya kubanga, aina amani aga sobo lo performing, ova anga zinguru, soka tinga tu planinga ba isande, tu kola echivulu echo, nenga lero te chisobo ka. Uh, that's not really good news coming in from Evelyn Lagu's camp. And uh, right here on the Buzz UG, uh, the Buzz family, uh, Evelyn Lagu, we wish you a very quick recovery. Now, in other news, uh, the Vice President of Uganda, Her Excellency Jessica Alupo, has opened up a private office located in Muyenga, and this office will be used to carry out secret political activities that are aimed at weakening His Excellency Bobby Wine's NUP party and his entire political network. Now, this office is going to be coordinated by a gentleman called Peter Abeine. Sources also reveal that Peter Abeine will so much focus on the Kampala ghettos so that to weaken Bobby Wine's ghetto roots. And also, defections from NUP party to NRM party will be passed through this office. However, a section of Ugandans are saying as long as the situation in Uganda remains as it is, even if President Museveni and his government succeeds in their mission to cripple Bobby Wine politically, the fight for freedom will not cease. <laughs> Now, in other news, uh, we all know right now Dr. Kiza Besije is in Luzira prison after protesting the current high commodity prices in Uganda. Now, Besije was charged with an offense of inciting violence. Now, Dr. Kiza Besije, through other FDC top leaders from Nakawa Division, has sent a very strong message to Bobby Wine and his entire national unity platform camp. Uh, Besige says Bobby Wine and his supporters should join him on the streets to rescue the country from President Museveni's government instead of mocking him on different social media platforms. Uh, Besige also promised that he will start from where he stopped as soon as he gets out of prison. But the leader of opposition in parliament, that is Honorable Mathas Mbuga, says people should stop questioning why NUP hasn't joined Dr. Kiza Besige's protests. Well, he says you don't have to wait for Bobby Wine to do anything. I mean, you can do it yourself in your own ways. 
Well, words of Honorable Mathas Mbuga, the leader of opposition in parliament, and that's the latest news coming in from Dr. Kiza Besuji's camp, and I'll definitely keep you posted. Now, in other news, a Mukono Municipality Member of Parliament, Honorable Bet Namboze, recently survived death after sleeping in a bathroom at her home in Mukono, and she's currently nursing wounds at Bugolobi Hospital. Now, the latest good news coming in from her camp, uh, doctors have confirmed that she did not injure her skull or even a blood clot. Well, it should be remembered that a few weeks back, Bududa Member of Parliament, Horrible Agnes Nandutu, survived death after collapsing in her bathroom. Uh, bathroom accidents are very serious, guys, and they hit differently, so I think we need to be very careful when we are showering. Well, horrible Betty Namboze right here on the Buzz UG, we wish you a very quick recovery. Now, in other news, uh, the police officers recorded in a video brutalizing Ronald Mumbere after handcuffing him have finally been arrested. Uh, this video has been trending and it was recorded in a park district, Ibuje Town Castle, and that is in northern Uganda. Uh, sources reveal that Ronald was working for a particular company that side and when he became so vocal on demanding his salary areas, you know, these police officers decided to pay him that way. But a very big section of Ugandans are very disappointed in these security officers. I mean, how do you treat your fellow Ugandan like this? Anyway, the good thing, they have been arrested and we hope that justice will prevail. That is it I got for you this morning on the Buzz UG. Uh, in case you haven't subscribed, kindly do subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. My name is Melad Milo, aka Fula. Thank you. Hey.